Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we have a challenge for me, not for you. I am doing this uh, one minute, 10 minute, and an hour practice challenge, but I thought I would up the game a little bit by challenging myself to play a piece that is not written for the cello, it's written for the violin, and also to play in the original register. So it's gonna sound super, super crazy. So I'm gonna try out the Mendelssohn Violin Concerto, yeah. I'm gonna try out the first page and a half. So I'm gonna first practice it for one minute and I'm just gonna side read it. So I, it's pretty high up there. So we'll see how we do. So I'm gonna practice for one minute. Here we go, start. I wasted three minutes itching my nose. Oh my god. I'm crazy. Why did I agree to this? legit practice it and make it sound somewhat in tune and decent even though it's totally not the cello register but we're gonna go for it anyway here we go and 10 minutes ready to start go use harmonic whenever I can now I just want to find the right fingerings I'm gonna go back and find fingerings We have five minutes and 46 minutes. I mean seconds left Let me just nail the parts. I know is trouble. So uh. Oh no, an octave higher. How do I find that note? Stop 
right here. It's too hard. <laughs> Plus, it's about a page and a half. I have two minutes and 12 seconds left. I'm gonna start where the problem starts, which is second page. As of now, I still don't know how I'm gonna find this note. To find it. Find the harmonic and then second finger. through obviously the first page is gonna sound a lot better the second page is treacherous um, and difficult and I haven't had as much time but let's play through what I got so far <laughs> it's gonna be dicey so bad you already heard in my practice so now I'm gonna go ahead and turn off the camera and practice this for a good full hour and um, I'll play the first page and a half I will check in once in a while with you guys and uh, we'll see if we can make it somewhat decent in an hour okay I'll be right back I'm putting a pause we had 39 minutes and 16 seconds oh my god this feels like forever um, the hardest challenges is like nailing the, those distances that I don't quite know where it is, you know, like here. Uh. Oh my god. That's hard. All right, I'm going back to practice. I'll check in again in a little bit. Now at 29 minutes and whatever it is, 38 seconds and... Uh, the biggest thing right now is finding fingerings for the second page. Uh, it's just really challenging. And I feel like that's half the battle, you know? It's just finding the fingerings. So let me play for you. So... Here. for that yet so I can't really play that yet otherwise it's a waste of time to practice it because I'm have a different set of fingerings so I just want to check in fingerings is a big thing nailing shifts moving onwards <laughs> okay I'm exhausted 10 seconds and we're near towards the end we're getting there um, I'm trying to incorporate a little bit of musicality even though I'm still dealing with the technical aspect of it so I'll play a little bit Like these jumps, just hard. Three minutes and a little bit left. Oh my goodness. Okay, this last touches. Oh my god, uh, the most difficult things. Uh, uh, I don't know. Oh, 
exhausting so I'm just gonna jump right into it and uh, it is what it is it may sound like crap I'm gonna do my best this is really hard I don't even know if any child has ever attempted this so um, yeah I'm just gonna do my best <laughs> Okay, now it's performance like this is the moment. Of course, it sounds much worse than when I was in practice. It's like a whole other thing to perform. And uh, this was a very good practice. I have to say that like when I'm practicing and I know I only have a certain amount of time to accomplish my goal, you're a lot more strategic about where you practice. So obviously I couldn't practice everything and perfect everything from the beginning. I just had to try to nail the things that I know is like the hardest, the jumps, you know, the triplets, even though it still sound like crap by the end, but it is what it is. So this is a really good practice. Let me know down below uh, what you thought, any comments about how, you know, you would practice differently if you had like a time limit. And let me know if there's another piece you want me to play. The honest truth is I played most of the cello rep, so it's not really fair for me to play something that I already know. So that's why I picked something that is ridiculously hard for me on a cello, like in the same register. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and share with friends. And yeah, I have other videos right here and right here that you want to check out some covers and some tutorials and other fun vlogs. And if you have other video ideas, let me know down below. I would love to hear from you and I'll see you next time. Bye.